Lock and load. So in Uncharted 1, near the end, you fought the cursed Spaniards and people didn't like them because they didn't realize that they needed to run and gun instead of aim and move slow. And people Imagine equally find that. the blue men kind of frustrating. And here's the thing. You only fight two blue men here. They just kind of pop out of there. I wish the game kind of pointed, hey, blue men are here. Take cover. Oh, the growling kind yeah. of... It's just hard to tell immediately point. where they come from. Oh, yeah. Right. But the thing is, blue men have golden crossbows. And they take very little damage from bullets, so you can sink like 150 AK rounds in one guy to kill him. But they're weak against explosives, and also the crossbows they drop when you kill them, two shots from one crossbow kills a blue man. That's incredible. Yep. Two crossbow shots or two grenades takes them out. <laughs> he hurt himself, what a dummy. They also aren't the brightest. No. So yeah, basically, once you're able to take out one guy, it's basically a chain reaction taking out all the others easily because you get the crossbow darts from all of them. Really need stronger weapons nice. Than this. That's <laughs> We're gonna need stronger weapons than this incredibly strong weapon. <laughs> so this, the golden crossbow counts as the same weapon as the normal crossbow, but yeah, the gold one does way more damage. It, it does more damage than any of the magnums do. Um, nice. It's the strongest gun in the game, aside from the RPG, actually. <laughs> Although, it, it does seem that they program some type of... Um, rock, paper, scissors type weaknesses to different types of weapons, because it's like, blue guys uh, don't take much damage from bullets, but explosives and crossbows do a ton. Um, normal uh, enemies that are wearing lots of armor, explosives and bullets do damage, but crossbows don't do a lot. Make these jumps. So yeah. Also grunting this part, by the way. I, I do love a good lady grunt. That's... Rawr. Yeah, you you go. How are you right. doing back there? Come We're on, coming. one more. Careful. Oh yeah, that's that's the stuff. <laughs> Careful. Be careful there. I hope I just made everyone at home really uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's sap. It's just like the rest. Stuff is flammable. Stand back. Stand back. What did you fire at it? What the hell? Oh my god, what is that? My flaming bullets. <laughs> too creepy. He's inherited the powers of Fitty Sun. It's okay. I can just shoot that treasure down, but let's blow it up with sap, I guess. Yep, yeah, save bullets. Mm hmm. Consummate. <laughs> so, how many uh, guys had to hit the thesaurus for these achievements? <laughs> we probably just have one intern whose whole job is to come up with crazy treasure hunting ranks. I'm, I'm sorry, but we need to include the word consummate for this to be labeled as edutainment. Mm -hmm. uh, we, we can get tax breaks for that. Yeah. If there's anything I learned from Uncharted 2, it wasn't anything about culture, it was about the word consummate. Yeah, I'm, 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 I'd like to make... Uh, yeah. yeah, how about that Uncharted 2? Mm -hmm. Boy howdy! <laughs> Let's go. I bet Drake would like to consummate with one of his treasure hunting friends. <laughs> Thank you, Tongue, for cooperating <laughs> with my crass statement. That looks familiar. Of course. That must be where the Chintamani stones. Ah yes. <laughs> it's all so beautiful. This place really must this place is a shithole. <laughs> does feel kind of haunted, doesn't it? I agree with Drake. I do not agree with Elena. This this is a dump right now. At this point in time, no. Oh, something I should mention is that the blue men that are dressed up as yetis, 
Um, the instant you first see the Yetis, you can, if you look carefully, you can see that the, it really is just a costume. <laughs> because um, their legs actually stick out of, like, the costume that they've made. Also, all the fur on it is exactly the same as the fur on the yaks. And, of course, they're just wearing yak skulls and horns. That's clever. I like that. Mm-hmm. But on your first time through, you're probably too busy trying not to die. Right. And building conspiracy theories about fur texture. Hmm. <laughs> uh. Hey, hey, what if I stand like a gorilla? Whoa, whoa, whoa. We got company. Again? Shh. Look, look, I'm a gorilla. <laughs> too damn quiet. Maybe they haven't seen us yet. Elena, get back. Maybe they think I'm a gorilla. <gasps> oh, these soldiers are crawling all over the place. I'm just a gorilla. <laughs> uh, bananas. Ook, ook, bananas. That's what's uh, in my hand. That's a banana. I'm doing sign language. Look. It's a shambal and banana. They're gun shaped, strangely enough. I know, but just trust me. It's a banana. Also, I'm very sorry I actually meant to speed this man walking up, but whatever. <laughs> it's not that bad. That's okay. Hey. I just get to think about gorillas. Mm -hmm. right. Wanna get that guy though, because he's got a magnum on him. Hmm. Unfortunately, I tried. Because um, there is a minigun man here. You cannot stealth kill minigun men, even if you do sneak up on them. They're just too big. Aww. Too big for Drake to wrap his arms around him. They're so fat it warps their peripheral vision to like a full 360. <laughs> wow. You got fat eyes, my friend. <laughs> Gotta do some eye exercises. Eye they, exercise. They have eyes on each side of their head like a lizard. You just can't tell because of that helmet they're wearing. Got big fat chameleon heads. There he is! <laughs> <laughs> Dude, shut the fuck up! Oh, kick your head off! Shut up, dude! What are you trying to do? Get me killed? God! Drake did the same thing to it to his little brother when they when his little brother's trying to rat him out to his parents for doing something bad. That's why Drake is an only child. Yep. These days. Yep. Poor Hank. Poor Hank. <laughs> <laughs> Popular name in, in the role of Uncharted. <laughs> Strangely enough. Top 10 names in Uncharted. Top 10 names in all of video games. <laughs> <laughs> Whoop, whoops. Whoop, hit up. Uh, whoop. Oh no, some blue men. And just to show that bullets don't do a lot, Magnum doesn't phase him a bit. Now excuse me while I do my cover dance. <laughs> hey, oh. Oh. It is the most sensual of all tangos. <laughs> it was a third person cover shooter hero's mating call. It was <laughs> rapidly changing from cover to cover. If only Drake had brighter plumage. Mm-hmm. The more virile mates use the 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 cover that's the most waist high of cover. <laughs> the more accurate to the height of their waist, the better. Although, if you really want to pick up a large volume of mates, you have to grow facial hair. Mm-hmm. If only I could take a minigun with me. Oh well. Is a minigun any good against the blue men? Yeah, just because nice. there's so just so many bullets. Hmm. Nice doorway. What you guys doing over here? Look at that man with an elephant for a chest. If any of you tried cranking this crank, you know. Damn it, it's stuck. I mean, just just instinct. The other counterweight's missing. Well, you look about the right size. <laughs> <laughs> Funny. Well, what? Try it. Seriously. <laughs> okay, you are. Yep.
Drake is the most handy tool in the shed. Well, he's not the sharpest, but that's not what we're going for. Okay, here we go. We just need to brute force everything. Drake's the tool you're looking for. Drake's a tool, all right. Uh, if only we had Flynn. We're cutting that a little fine. Well, maybe he's sharper than I thought. Hmm. Whoop! That tree disappeared. That's weird. Oh no! The perfect game ruined. What happened? I may or may not have accidentally thrown a grenade into a corner and blown myself up. Yeah, I doubt it. That's actually what happened. <laughs> they should have more of that blue resin all over the place. Use it like explosive barrels. Oh, you can actually. There's some oh, up ahead. Awesome. Yep. Some. Well, you can't see it right now. But there's a sniper up there, and there's some uh, sap right next to him. Nice. And right there. Yeah, alright. Does the same amount of damage as an explosive barrel and everything. <laughs> yes. Why do I get the feeling you measured that yourself? Uh, mm. Either through experimentation or uh, looking at the game code somehow. It might have happened. <laughs> <laughs> that noise! I love no. it! No. I love the grenade launcher. You guys all right? It's my favorite gun in the whole game. Hey, uh, I'm gonna try to save you guys better than when we saved Jeff. I'm still sorry about that. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's raining and all, so it kind of just brings up all those old memories. Yeah, you, you guys seem to have forgotten about it, I, but... Well, I mean, Blue Men is a lot to have on your mind. It, it weighs heavy on my heart, the way that guy died with his camera and, and his hat. No, 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 we left the camera behind, so all he really had as a defining feature was his hat. Well, and that jelly in his pocket. Yeah, whatever. Sorry I squished your last sandwich, Jeff. I eat it though, it's pretty good. Yeah. Oh, there's a bunch of sap right over here. Ah! Yeah, there is. <laughs> Never mind. You good job looking out, Nate. Okay. Looks like we need to get up to that ledge. Let's use the cart. There you go. Or we could just stack up all the dead men. No, no, no. Come on, let's That's make a pyramid out of them. Thanks for the help, Chloe. Let's be a little way. decent once in a while. Okay. <sighs> Don't want to go up yet, because there's a treasure right over here. And I think this is the weird treasure, I'm pretty sure. Yep. <laughs> it's the weird treasure. Unusual bronze mask. I'll say. <laughs> it looks like one of those stress things where you squeeze and its face explodes. <laughs> yeah. I really don't know what is up with the unusual mask. I don't, maybe it's an in-joke or something. I'm so glad you found me, Drake! <laughs> I've been so bored without anyone to talk to! Holy... Just this weird buzzing noise, and it's driving me nuts! <laughs> just one blue man just blowing on that weird instrument that I can never remember the name to. Did you redo? Yeah. I want one, kind of. I use it as, like, a coat rack or something. Mm hmm. Curtain rod, did you redo? So you got a bunch of goons and a whole bunch of blue men fighting each other, and it's actually just perfectly fine to sit here and watch them fight for a little bit. Let them just weed each other out. And it doesn't really turn out the same way every time. Sometimes the goons win and sometimes the blue men win. Um, the blue men are kind of winning this time. It really usually depends on whether or not they can take out the minigun guy. If they yeah. take him out fast, then the blue guy's probably going to win. 
but I do like this room just because you got so three parts. So when you say this is a balanced map, absolutely. <laughs> oh man, that guy's just making way too much noise. Mm -hmm. Twelve-year-olds with their headsets. God. Oh, there are too many men right over there. Give me that rocket. <laughs> and whoever had to play the bongos in this song is just going insane. <laughs> Listen to him. They found that one guy who is at the beatnik club. It really wasn't into the scene, he just liked it for the bongos. <laughs> What's really Finally, great though... Finally, I got to jam out! Yes! It was entirely coincidental, but thank you, Bongo Man. He ended his bongos right when I headshotted that guy with the last bullet in my pistol. Thank you. <laughs> made it cool. They just keep coming. It's not often bongos make something cool. <laughs> When the blue men die, they just look like they get tired. I threw that grenade too far. Oh. Oh. Look at him, he's just sitting down. <laughs> wow, that one's not nearly sleepy enough. I know. Come on, go to sleep! Lots of bullets. I don't even get to kill this guy, I think Elena kills him. That's yep. my girl. All right. He kills him. Stealing my kills, Elena. Mm. These guys with all their crazy arms and the why weird hitbox. You, why would you do that? Do what? Why would you try to shoot down a treasure with the crossbow? Because the next area is full of guns. And it doesn't really matter. Oh, okay. It's That's positively normal after the I, last one. I know. This is kind of this point, it's like, the last treasure isn't the weird guy. It should be, because every other treasure is going to be a disappointment after that. Yep. Stone's got to be here somewhere. Let's try heading up. Oh man, right. blue fire. I wonder what they burn to make it blue. I also wonder what they burn to make it anti-gravity, just flying. Yeah. <laughs> Must be using some superconductors or something. They can do some crazy stuff with superconductors. Obviously it was aliens. Mm-hmm. Come on. We better hurry. We gotta go hide in a fridge. Come on. Stairmaster. <sighs> yeah, I'd be done. I'd be done. I'd be done after the first two. Oh, where are the ancient mystical right. elevators? Oh. Almost there. Whoop. Don't want to go up there yet. I'll do a counterweight puzzle. Anything. Final treasure. Yay. All 101 of them. Do still don't know how I ended up with 102 in my original file. Really? That's the last one? Yep. You don't get an achievement thing for the last one? You Well, I got an achievement for the 100th one. This is the 101st because the, the secret Jack and Daxter one doesn't count oh, okay. towards. Well, so I yeah. missed it. What What is the adjective beyond consummate? I think it's master. Oh, okay. It should be something a lot more esoteric. Mm -hmm. It should be the esoteric treasure hunter. Yep. Magnificent. <laughs> Now let's smash it and get the hell out of here. Uh, wait. But I want to be immortal. So no I want to hug it. I want to lick it. Mean? Looks like candy. Look at it. Well, there should be a shitload of chunks taken out of it if all the stories are true. Marco Polo had it wrong. <laughs> this isn't a sapphire. It's amber. Amber. Yeah, you know, fossilized resin. Hmm. Haven't you ever watched Jurassic Park? Wait a minute. What is it? Isn't amber usually the color of amber? God, me. It's special oh, amber. Nate, I hate it when he does this. Tell me about it. 
Somebody a long time ago accidentally dumped some food coloring into the tree. It's the resin, the sap from the tree of life. Okay, hold on. Now you've lost me. This tree. No. That tree. Oh. Well, that's just a jungle, Drake. <laughs> Trust me, I'm a gorilla. Yes. I know my trees. Lazarevich. He's headed to the tree. Oh my god. The black teeth. What? The black teeth on those guardian things and the bodies in Borneo. They ate the resin and it changed them somehow. And you think that's what Lazarevich is planning to do? You really want to wait around and find out? Bravo, shut up. Yeah, Th Flynn's well, not so dumb now, Flynn? is he? <gasps> well, he was because he chased you there instead of just going to the damn tree, but... Mm -hmm. Disappointed Lazara bitch beat you to it. I'm afraid you just missed him. Figured I'd stay behind and wait for you to come join my little party. What are you talking about? <laughs> Maybe that's what old Zoran wanted all along, eh? He's cleverer than he looks. Well, we can still stop. He's more than just a bad guy. Elena, don't. No, we can help. Well, I don't know about that. Sorry, Once you get to know him, he's it's way true. more bad than bad guy. And you're not the plucky girl who reforms the villain and saves the day. It's just not done like that. Flynn, listen to me. You... Parting gift. Oh, well, that's something. Pity he took the pin. Get back! Elena! Oh! <laughs> oh, God, I have Flynn all over me. No. Gross. That's the last thing I wanted. Oh my god. Helena. Uh, okay. You're gonna be okay. Come on, we're gonna get you out of here. Chew some resin. Stop, Lazarevich. Go. Mm. Not a chance. Come on. Why are you being so nice? Come on. I don't believe this for a second. <laughs> Shit. Right, Drake will this. never have sex with me again if I let his other girlfriend die. Oh, uh, gotta be nice this one time. I guess. Well, she is another gun. <laughs> Wait, she can still shoot in this state? Well, she was another gun. Oh. I was gonna say, that that's just icing on the Elaine is the best character ever cake. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, she doesn't shoot at this part. It would be great if she shot very rarely, if every shot was a headshot or something. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've got five bullets. I'll headshot five guys for you. Here I go. And I'll get the dudes with the shotguns, too, because they're the biggest jerks. She takes out a minigun just with a look. Wow. She looks very disappointed in them, and they go, All right. Okay, and then his they head just, just explodes. You're already dead. I wish there were still more treasures to get. Like in the middle of this intense firefight. Ooh, the treasure! Mm. And then kill another five men. By that time, you're just really looting their pockets. <laughs> you're stealing the treasures they stole uh, from the other path. Mm hmm. Elena, you alright? <laughs> I'm not gonna help anything, I'm just gonna ask. I'm more moral support at this point. <laughs> uh, I think that's where I work best. I think that's the last of them. Wow, they sped up. Mm -hmm. Hey, Elena, how you doing, huh? Not good. You just Don't say that in front of her. Everybody hurts. Um, go as fast as you can. What, what, what do you mean? No. No way. Look, Chloe, I have to end He's this. the final Don't. boss, come on! Don't you dare take on this <laughs> stupid I gotta do it! Okay. Just get her come out. on, he's the last part of the Not game. You. Anything I can do to bring the credits. The credits are her only hope. <laughs> as soon as they roll, <laughs> no one else dies. I I, look, I blew up a train. I can blow up a tree. And you know it. I can blow up a man. <laughs> I've blown up so many men. As far away from this place as you can. What is a tree but a really big man? 